ABC 7 business commentator Richard Stern joining us now. And Richard, some down arrows across the board on Wall Street today. Down arrows all the way across the board, but in truth, the biggest loss of the day was three-tenths of one percent. So I don't think we have too much to complain about. We've had a pretty good run going on. Indeed, it was a down day, although the Dow opened higher. The Dow was up by 29 points early this morning, down by 125 points at the low of the day. So as you can see, 154 point range. Perhaps most surprising was the NASDAQ. It had been up for four days in a row, and it was up all day long today until about 10 minutes before the close. And yes, indeed, a down arrow. Let's take a look at the final numbers for the day. There you see the Dow down 77 points, three-tenths of 1% at 25,656.98. That on volume of 801 million shares. The NASDAQ, as I say, up all day, but not at the close. Down almost 11 points, 13 one-hundredths of 1% 1 at 7,878.46. That on volume of 1,718,000,000 shares. And the S&P makes it a clean sweep down five points, not quite two-tenths of 1% at 2,856.98. Well, it was quite a day for Williams Sonoma. If you're familiar with that company, well, its shares jumped by a whopping 16% today after the company announced not only positive earnings, they said their same store sales were up by almost 5% and they expected more going forward. In case you're not familiar, Williams Sonoma owns stores by the names of Williams Sonoma, Pottery Barn, and West End. And perhaps the most surprising statistic to me, listen to this, 54% of their total sales were done through e-commerce. So it's not only Amazon that owns that uh, kind of uh, footprint in the retail world. As you see, 54%, I don't know about you, but I find that to be a huge number for a company like that. That's impressive. Yeah, it did very well. And then uh, news on the struggles at Sears. Yeah, unimpressive, I'm afraid. Closing 46 more stores. Oh. Two of them in Florida, one in Miami, one in Naples, so we're not affected immediately, but boy, oh boy. Once an American retail icon, yeah. not so anymore. All right, Richard, thank you so much. You're very welcome.